Bills, bills. I feel like I should just give up hope. Bills and more bills. I quit my second job so I could have more time for school. I'm drowning in debt and I'm not the only one. Most people don't realize that 75% of college students face the challenges I face. We're on our own and we're working as hard as we can to get ahead and we're struggling. Let's take America to college. It's our chance to be heard. A stereotypical student would be going to school at 9 a.m. I have to go to work at 9 a.m. and then I would have to go to school at night. I work full time. I go to school at night. I have court during the day, then I have my regular shift, which is 4 to midnight. Drove by Bunk Hill Community College and I saw the sign that said burn the midnight oil. And I knew those were the classes for me. And it's very hard. I mean, there's so many people in college right now. They work two full-time jobs and they go to college. A year ago today, I didn't even have a high school credential. I was in jail. Now I'm a college student and I'm just a change man and I'm going to push for hours. Every day is difficult. I'm emotionally stressed. How am I going to get back and forth to school? I don't have a job, so how am I going to constantly have money? Okay, good to go. Not an option because it's going to cost me a hell of a lot more money to ride the subway than just keep running. I don't have that much money left. Does it have to be this hard? What do you think? I'm going to Washington next week with the Take America to College team. Policymakers want more of us to graduate from college. We know what it takes. Go to TakeAmericaToCollege.com and tell them, Take America to College, your college, our America.